You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. So, what are y'all keeping the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. Well, someone's getting a little curious, aren't they? I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Before she died, we met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. It sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out in the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? Means you can't trust them. Any of them. I think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. Fair enough. Well, we got nothing useful out of her. Let's see what's going on down here. Danny, we've already spoken to you. So, let's see what's going on up there. Larry's probably annoyed with me now. Scoop de doo. Yes, I can in fact talk to him. So let's see what he has to say. Ooh, maybe I can convince him to try and kill Andy. That'll be a good distraction. Because he's so good at trying to kill people. Aren't you, Larry? So, Larry, it uh, looks like you're getting along with Brenda pretty well. You know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? How about you try not trying to kill me, huh? Hmm? Yeah, maybe? Lily. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. Take our food and mark and go. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Will do, as soon as we get off this scene. Good. Okay. Now, as far as distractions go, I reckon the generator might cause some fiddling. So let's see what's going on with it. Yes, I can indeed use it. Da -da 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 -da. Power switch. Of course, this is incredibly dangerous. The zombies could come at this exact moment and murder us, but just in case they don't. Okay. Damn, this thing is the worst piece of shit. Something's always tripping the breaker. Oh. Well, that distraction didn't last too long. But maybe I can do something a wee bit more sophisticated with it. Come on. So let's see what else we got here. Aha! Access let's get in there. Hmm. Guess I'm gonna need a screwdriver for this. Try the da 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 multi tool. Beautiful. Looks like that bellstrap in the, uh, whatchamacallit, um... Ow! Damn it! Thing is moving fast! Use the da 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 multi tool! Ow! Damn it! Thing is moving fast! What do you mean, ow? The multi tool isn't, extens isn't an extension of your hand. But maybe if we turn it off. And then. <clears throat> that thing is on too tight for my bare hands. Well then use the ba ba da ba multi tool. There, 
That should do it. Ha, <laughs> pockets it as well. Just so that there is no hope for us if the walkers come. Fucking Danny, where'd he find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing threw a bill. Damn it, dog. Ah, oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this will take forever. I like how his voice clearly said fuck, whereas the subtitles are trying to trick us into thinking he's a frack. Just like earlier it said crap, whereas he clearly said shit. <laughs> Why are the subtitles so polite? Anyway, he's going to be out here for a while, because he seems to think that staring at the place where the belt should be is somehow going to get another belt there, which means that I have got plenty of time to do my thing. There's a baby in there? Seven babies. Careful, don't spook her. Ooh. Clementine? Hey, Clementine. My hat! You found it! I sure I knew did. you'd find it. You said you would. And I never Listen, lie. Did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Do you think you'll ever have kids? I don't know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Okay, so a plot is thickening. But first, let's see what's behind this door. <gasps> Maybe Jesus is in this one. I didn't see this one. But... Mom! Dad! Dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Okay. I always thought that bell was signaling the arrival of Jesus, but I guess not. Okay. Multitool! Oh yeah. He is better at unscrewing screws than I am. He's just letting the screws fall to the floor. That's... Okay, he's not as good at screwing screws as I am. I'd at least catch the damn things. Okay. We are getting close to the truth. Maybe Jesus is in here. This is not Jesus. This isn't Jesus Boy, at all. Didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. They killed Jesus. Now I'm starting to see where this is all going. You god murdering sons of biscuits. Oh, Brenda, you wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse boy. a mess, we had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and Ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Horses are for riding, not eating. It. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. <sighs> it's true, I have. Just love to muck around. Let's see what's going this on here. This must be Terry. Hey, Terry. Okay. Uh, let's see what drugs they have. Ah, good old shaving cream. I uh, could use a shave. It's true, you could. Gauze pads. Yes. Some kind of lotion. It puts the lotion on the skin. 
or else it murders Jesus in the back of the barn again. Come on, close it. Now, wash your... There's no option to do that. Well, I am just insulted. Let's just sneak up the stairs then. Seems like something we should do. Sneaky, sneaky stairs. Sneaking up the stairs. I wonder what there is to find. There's always that one creaky step in every set of stairs in existence. Except one's made of stone, obviously. Brr, okay. Let's see what we've got. Is Ben in here? Ben? What am I saying, Ben? I mean Mark. Do I mean Mark? Yes, I mean Mark. Ben's the kid. Alright. You said blood? Probably from when the arrow was taken out, but most importantly, I'm seeing no Mark. Where the hell is Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. Feels like there's a storm coming. Yeah, and it sounds like that as well, you fuel. Uh, farm books, cookbooks, nothing out of the ordinary here. What's that picture? I can't make out the picture. Is that a dog? Can't really see. Okay. Well, looks like there's nothing else to be found in here, so let's go check out that closet. Closet. Come on, I don't have that much time. Washing your hands does not take this long. Okay, we have got morphine. What do they need so much morphine for? For sedating Jesus. Candles. Smart. Candles are very cool. Except for the fact that they contain fire, which is hot. Musty as hell. Indeed, those jerks do not clean their towels. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. It was Jesus. Ugh, what is this stuff? Rock. Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? The plot is thickening like curdled milk. Huh, where is that cord going? Let us use our magic to find out. Da 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 da. What the hell? Ooh, I think I know what's going on. They have a secret hidden room. And inside that room is the Holy Grail. We've got to find it. Come on. We need that Grail. Yes. All the glory of God is to be mine. Just past this wooden door. Oh no. That's not the Holy Grail. Lee. Oh. Mark. What the hell happened? That is not how you fix an arrow wound. Brothers. What the hell happened to your legs, man? I think she's just made it worse. Don't eat. Well, that's a bit spiteful. Just because you've lost your legs doesn't mean I'm not entitled to a good meal. That's just like, oh, I'm not happy, so you can't be happy either. Anyway, alright, okay, I've got to stop Clementine because now I'm spiteful. Clem, Clemmy Clem. Clementine, no! Don't do it! <laughs> Lee, Jesus, Jesus, man. Did you find something? Aw, oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's crazy. The hell? So, yeah. You're scaring the kids, You know Lee? what's gotten into you? Lee, what legs. the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. It's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. Logic. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat 